Hello, my YouTubers. What's up, passions? Gosh. <laughs> we had appetizers and wine inside. At one point, my hair was like Halle Berry's. Like, oh my God. That was when I was in Hawaii. Passions, Merry Christmas. What a cold and beautiful Christmas morning. Oh, God, no snow. All this freezing, 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 freezing weather and no snow. I am so blessed, so blessed to be here this morning. And I'm so grateful. Please let's not forget what today's all about. It's not the gift that you receive or the ones that you give, but it's the gift of God the birth of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, a blessed Christmas. I hope that you got everything your heart desires and, you know, you were able to give to those that mean so much to you. But, um, yeah, I'm going to put up receipts. Receipt. I was over at TMR's channel enjoying her um, reaction. I so love her. Oh, my God. When I got off YouTube, I kind of, you know, stopped watching everyone, including TMR. Every now and then I would just kind of, you know, jump on her channel like for a few minutes and I'll jump back off. But yeah, so when I jumped, decided to jump back in, I knew exactly where to go. I knew that if anyone could get me back in the, in the excitement of those young women, it will be TMR. So I watched her reaction on Jasmine's um, video, I think a night out before winter storm. And before she started talking about that video of Jasmine's, she shared with us, as you guys can see, the receipt. Okay, passions, so. I was over at TMR, you know, trying to catch up on the gossip, trying to um, sip some tea with the rest of her gang. Um, and damn, damn, she came up with receipt, okay? And I had to take me a screenshot of this. Jasmine, what do you have to say for yourself? So apparently, um, YouTube investigators, okay, went and dug up some documentation information that Jasmine was pulled over at some point in time, okay, in December, I believe it was December 8th, okay, and reason for her being pulled over was for um, failure to meet financial responsibilities, okay, on the vehicle that she was in. I'm not sure, I am not sure if it's like um, they're not paying the insurance or they're not making payments. But one of the two, maybe both, is not being paid according to their agreement with the finance company. So, yes, I heard it from TMR first. And if you guys haven't heard the news yet, because, honey, I am so late with the news, because y'all know me, I'm never on time, okay? Never, for nothing, okay? So, I was like, what? So, apparently... The truck is gone. Now, don't quote me on this because I don't know. I don't know how truthful this gossip is. I do not know how sweet the tea is. But honey, sip, 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 sip. This could be proof that the truck is gone. Sadly, now... We are all under the understanding that Mama Dukes put her name on the dotted line on those documentation 
for that truck. And if that is true, if that is true, if that is true, if that is so, okay. Damn, there goes her credit. And Jasmine said recently when she cussed her mama out that her mother don't do nothing for her. Damn. Mm, 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 mm. Cause y'all know in America we are known by the numbers, honey. The credit score and the social security. Okay. So if you guys want more information on on that situation on, go over to your mom because she have it in full detail. I'm telling you, that lady is the top of the game here on YouTube when it comes to reaction. Okay? Oh, my God. I love listening to her. So when I am falling behind or I don't know what the hell is going on and this mustard needs to catch up, that is where I go over there to Dijon. Okay? Dijon, girl. So, yes. Damn. See? Us to make it have a saying. Never put your hat where your hands cannot reach. And do not cut your nose to spoil your face. Do not pretend you have what you don't, Jasmine. Because if you can't afford something, don't put yourself in debt for a man. Just make a nigga feel good and look good so he can stay with your ass. Okay? Damn. So... Like I'm like I'm saying, y'all, I don't know how true the story is. Someone could have forged some papers and just putting it out here just to, you know, get on Jazzy's case. I'll give Jazzy a migraine or a nervous breakdown. But um, yeah, that's the word on the curve. Okay, Jasmine, if you cannot financially afford something, do not put yourself in a situation that would just screw you up financially. Okay? Damn. Mama Dukes, your credit. Okay. You cannot be financially okay and you're getting cars taken away for not meeting financial obligations. So let's get into this video here. Okay, here we go. This is 40 minutes. I don't have. Are you looking at dead at me? Are you looking at me? Hold on, okay, video is saying a night out before winter winter storm. Okay, so my little setup here. I don't feel like going downstairs. It's too damn cold. I have heater on on every single except no, on the first floor. And the top floor, not the lower level. No, don't have the heater on, and I do not feel like going down there. Do this video. I've learned a lot with editing from doing my TikTok, so I've, I've gained some knowledge. As you guys can see, I'm learning. There's a lot more that I don't know. All right, this is ridiculous. Come on now. There's a lot more I need to learn. Okay, well, shit, wait. Oh, y'all, yeah, wait. Hell. Oh, yeah. This is a part right here I wanted to speak on. 
overdoing it sometimes. It's makeup. They God, God. God damn, y'all. Like, so right here is where Jasmine have left over makeup on her face, and someone is commenting that like the, the crisp punch in the face <laughs> but it's just old stale makeup as you guys can see it's dark it's night time so um why this young lady could not have washed her face before she left the house i don't know if you're gonna have dirty feet in your house you're gonna walk outside where you have your dog feces and just all kind of dirtiness and germs and shit and go like and you're gonna walk back into your house lay on your sofa walk on the floor where your kid or your children plays okay and probably drop food and pick it back up pick it back up and put it back put it in their mouth hey why would jasmine wash her face before she leaves her house okay these are things that young nasty gal nothing for do okay Dimba buckets don't think about doing stuff like that okay so chris is getting all kind of high rate and bothered that someone made a comment about him hitting jasmine i don't know if chris hit jasmine i don't know and i don't care that's between jasmine even if chris is physically abusing jasmine allegedly Okay, no one can help Jasmine but Jasmine. Out of all the questions in the world of us talking about, of us, all the conversation in the world about us talking about it, the, um, the, uh, her subscribers questioning him or her about it or writing it in the comment section, it's not going to save Jasmine. Okay. So, me personally, if you should ask me what I think, I think Jasmine's being abused in some way. Um, but I, I don't, I don't know how. You have different types of abuse: physically, emotionally, and mentally. Okay, so here we go. God damn, y'all, like, it's I don't makeup. know how I be touching this woman. <laughs> it's makeup, okay? Damn. I don't know how I be touching her at all. If I touch her, it's in a good way mm -hmm. to where she's being pleased. I don't yeah, know amazing. Touching her. So, he's saying he does not touch Jasmine. An, abuse, an abusive man is not going to say that he abuses his woman, especially on such a large public platform. That's going to make him look like an ass, okay? Jasmine, the person who's been abused, it's not going to say that she is being abused because it's embarrassing. It's humiliating. Even though she knows it's wrong. Okay. She doesn't want to be right because Christopher is there. One way or another, he's given her something. It may not be all the time, but she's getting something from him. Just to know that she has a man that is home. That is in her bed, that sexes her when he wants to or when she needs him to. I don't know how that goes. Okay. I have been in abusive relationships. Well, one relationship. I know that no abuser is going to say, Yes, I hit her and I knocked up her shit last night too. They're not going to say that. They're going to defend. Even when they are caught in the act like my ex was when I stabbed him in the chest and took his finger off, okay, with his help, he still told them cops, no, he was not hitting me. It was my fault, okay? Abusers do not admit to their levels, of hurting the abusee. Okay? So, I'm not going to take that as a no. 
Everyone else can take it, but I'm not taking it. Touching her like that? Like, it's literally makeup. It's all yeah. over. I was, cause I was, I, this is what I do. And I forgot that I had makeup on. I took my lashes off. I to Jasmine looks like a man. Like, when she's not wearing <laughs> her makeup her and her wig, she looks like <laughs> such a, a male person. <laughs> like a I was rubbing man. my eyes like this when I was editing. And I forgot, I took my lashes off and I forgot that I had eyeliner and eyeshadow on my eyes. And I was like, oh, shit. I probably Should've look crazy your face, Jasmine. everywhere. Because <laughs> I just wiped it off. Mm. Let me wipe it all the way off because y'all not y'all be doing. Chris loves his woman. Yeah, he loves me. Let me hear Chris tell you that. Can I hear Chris tell you that? They try to say he don't love me. He love me. Somebody try, they try to be trying to say that he, he cheating on me. <laughs> y'all be, be more pressed than anybody in the world. It's Jesus. so crazy. Did he say he's not? It's so crazy. Now look at that. Fuck. Hold on. I'm sleepy. Damn. Wedding plans. Now Damn. look at that. Jasmine is sitting right next to Chris. And Jasmine mentioned that people are saying that Chris cheats on her. Chris does not love her. Okay. And she's saying Chris doesn't love me. Chris cheats on me. Chris hits me. Then she mentioned wedding plans. And the only thing he defend was the hidden her part. Okay, because you can get in some you can get in some trouble for that. Okay? You can get arrested for that. You can get locked the fuck up for that. Okay? But when she mentioned the I love you, he didn't like pull her over to him and kiss her cheek and says, of course I love my baby. You know, give her a kiss on the cheek and reassure her and show the audience that I love my woman. Then when she said Chris cheating on me, he didn't say, he didn't defend that. It didn't, he didn't, maybe, maybe I could, you know, if that's the case, I could say, well, maybe he doesn't physically hit her, but if he hitting shit around the house, Okay, or punching his fist through the wall or punching dents in a refrigerator or tossing shit over the house, which that would lead eventually lead to physical assault. Because when you when you can't find something to punch, you're going to punch a person who's pissing the fuck off. Okay, like I've said, I've been in this relationship. I know how it works. Not theirs. I mean, my own physical abuse relationship, my own, you know domestic violence relationship okay he didn't defend the cheating he didn't defend the um i love you does he have to no he doesn't need to he ain't got chris not to prove shit to us but he made sure he proved he made sure he spoke on the abuse part okay because the abuse part makes him look bad. Okay? Makes him look bad. The I love you, the reassurance that he loves Jasmine, right? Would make Jasmine feel good. And we all know Chris don't like it when Jasmine feels good, especially when she's on camera. Okay, I've been gone, but I haven't forgotten. Okay, it may have been MIA. Okay, but but I remember shit. Let's carry on. Sleepy. Damn. Wedding plans. Man, y'all man, look. Y'all leave that alone, please. When it happened, it happened. Y'all will know. I promise y'all. Right now, just let it rock, man. Y'all enjoy enjoy the, enjoy the journey. How about that? Enjoy the journey. Please, just enjoy That's the one job. ugly man. Oh, you put the phone on? Yeah, so you can talk. Yeah, and Julie's been... Why do you look like that? Why do you wear your eyes? I ain't roll my eyes. You did. Send your step back. <laughs> you looking at dead at me? Hmm? You looking at me? Hold on, y'all. Okay. Video is saying a night out before winter's winter storm. Okay, so my little setup here. 
I don't feel like going downstairs. It's too damn cold. I have heater on on every single, except, no, only the first floor and the top floor. Not the lower level, no. Don't have the heater on and I do not feel like going down there. Do this video. I've learned a lot with editing from doing my TikTok. So I've, I've gained some knowledge. As you guys can see, I'm learning. There's a lot more that I don't know. All right, this is ridiculous. Come on now. A lot more I need to learn. Okay, well, shit, wait. All y'all wait. Hell. Okay, oh, this is a part right here oh. I wanted to speak on. So, right here is where Jasmine have left over makeup on her face. And someone is commenting that, like, the, the Chris punch you in the face. <laughs> But it's just old, stale makeup. As you guys can see, it's dark. It's nighttime. So um, why this young lady could not have washed her face before she left the house, I don't know. If you're going to have dirty feet in your house, you're going to walk outside where you have your dog feces and just all kind of dirtiness and germs and shit. And, go like, and you're going to walk back into your house. Lay on your sofa, walk on the floor where your kid or your children plays, okay, and probably drop food and pick it back up, pick it back up and put it back, put it in their mouth. Hey, why would Jasmine wash her face before she leaves her house? Okay, these are things that young nasty gal not think for do. Okay, dimba buckets don't think about doing stuff like that. Okay, so Chris is getting all kind of high rate and bothered that someone made a comment about him hitting Jasmine. I don't know if Chris hit Jasmine. I don't know and I don't care. That's between Jasmine. Even if Chris is physically abusing Jasmine, allegedly, okay, no one can help Jasmine but Jasmine. Out of all the questions in the world of us talking about, of us, all the conversation in the world about us talking about it, the, um, the, uh, her subscribers questioning him or her about it or writing it in the comment section, it's not going to save Jasmine. Okay? So... Me personally, if you should ask me what I think, I think Jasmine's being abused in some way. Um, but I, I don't I don't know how. You have different types of abuse. Physical, emotional, physically, emotionally, and mentally. Oh dear God, here we go again. This thing just gets on my freaking nerves. Okay, so here we go. God damn, y'all, like, this how do I be touching this woman? It's makeup, okay? Damn, how do I be touching her at all? If I touch her, it's in a good way mm -hmm. to where she's being pleased. Yeah, so, he's saying he does not touch Jasmine. An abuse. An abusive man is not going to say that he abuses his woman, especially on such a large public platform. That's going to make him look like an ass. Okay. Jasmine, the person who's been abused, is not going to say that she is being abused because it's embarrassing. It's humiliating. Even though she knows it's wrong. Okay. She doesn't want to be right because Christopher is there. One way or another, he's given her something. It may not be all the time, but she's getting something from him. Just to know that she has a man that is home, that is in her bed, that sexes her, 
when he wants to or when she needs him to. I don't know how that goes. Okay. I have been in abusive relationships. Well, one. Relationship. I know that no abuser is going to say, yes, I hit her. And I knocked up her shit last night too. They're not going to say that. They're going to defend. Even when they are caught in the act like my ex was. When I stabbed him in the chest and took his finger off. Okay. With his help. He still told them cops. No, he was not hitting me. It was my fault. Okay. Abusers do not admit to their levels of hurting the abusee okay so i'm not going to take that as a no everyone else can take it but i'm not taking it touch her like that like it's literally makeup it's all yeah. over I was, cause I was, I, this is what I do, and I forgot that I had makeup on. I took my lashes off. So I to that Jasmine looks like a man. Like when she's not wearing <laughs> her makeup her, and her wig, them. she looks like and such a male person. <laughs> like a I was rubbing my eyes like this when I was editing, and I forgot. I took my lashes off, and I forgot that I had eyeliner and eyeshadow on my eyes, and I was like, oh shit. I probably look crazy. Your face, Jasmine. <laughs> Everywhere. Because <laughs> I just wiped it off. Mm. Let me wipe it all the way out because y'all not y'all be doing. Chris loves his woman, yeah, he loves me. Let me hear Chris tell you that. Can I hear Chris tell you that? They try to say he don't love me. He love me. Somebody try they try to be trying to say that he he cheating on me. <laughs> y'all be, be more pressed than anybody in the world. It's Jesus. so crazy. Did he say he's not? It's so crazy. Now look at that. Fuck. Hold on. I'm sleepy. Damn. Wedding plans. Now look yeah. at that. Jasmine is sitting right next to Chris. And Jasmine mentioned that people are saying that Chris cheats on her. Chris does not love her. Okay. And she's saying, Chris doesn't love me. Chris cheats on me. Chris hits me. Then she mentioned wedding plans. And the only thing he defend was the hidden her part okay because you can get in some you can get in some trouble for that okay and get arrested for that you can get locked the fuck up for that okay but when she mentioned that i love you he didn't like pull her over to him and kiss her cheek and says of course i love my baby you know give her a kiss on the cheek and reassure her and show the audience that I love my woman. Then when she said Chris cheating on me, he didn't say, he didn't defend that. It didn't, he didn't, maybe, maybe I could, you know, if that's the case, I could say, well, maybe he doesn't physically hit her, but he'd be hitting shit around the house, okay? Or punching his fist through the wall or punching dents in the refrigerator or tossing shit over the house, which that would lead, eventually lead to physical assault. Because when you, when you can't find something to punch, you're going to punch a person who's pissing the fuck off. Okay? Like I've said, I've been in this relationship. I know how it works. Not theirs. I mean, my own physical abuse relationship, my own, you know, domestic violence relationship. Okay? He didn't defend the cheating. He didn't defend the um, I love you. Does he have to? No, he doesn't need to. He ain't got Chris not to prove shit to us. But he made sure he proved. He made sure he spoke on the abuse part. Okay? Because the abuse part makes him look bad. Okay? Makes him look bad. The I love you. The reassurance that he loves Jasmine. Right? Would make Jasmine feel good. 
And we all know Chris don't like it when Jasmine feels good, especially when she's on camera. Okay, I've been gone, but I haven't forgotten. Okay, it may have been MIA. Okay, but but I remember shit. Let's carry on. Leave me. Damn. Wedding plans. Man, y'all, man, look. Y'all leave that alone, please. When it happened, it happened. Y'all will know, I promise y'all. Right now, just let it rock, man. Y'all enjoy, enjoy, the, enjoy the journey. How about that? Enjoy the journey. Please, just enjoy That's the journey. That's one ugly man. Oh, you put the phone on? Yeah, so you can talk. Yeah, enjoy the journey. Why do you look like that? Why do you wear your eyes? I ain't wrong my eyes. You did. Send your stepdad. Um, <laughs> go work. Go work. Don't try to play with me. You I didn't. Yes, you did. I was looking at stinker butt. You God, they both eyes. so fat. You exactly again. Why are you wearing your eyes? Okay, so someone asked about the wedding. Okay, are they gonna get married? I mean, Jasmine shows everything on her, on her channel. Now, I have been gone for a minute. The only video I saw speaking on that was a video I kind of glimpsed for like maybe like 10 seconds. Let me stop lying. I'm going to say about 20 seconds. Seriously. And she mentioned what plans and we'll know she's got a lot of plans, wedding plans, and she wants to lose weight before she have a baby shit like that. Jasmine, I'm 100% sure had Christopher, okay, that guy over there. The one that looked like um, Humpty Dumpty, Humpty Dumpty, or Mr. Potato Head. Had Chris proposed to Jasmine, we would have seen a vlog on that. Would have seen a video on that. Chris said, let it happen. Enjoy the journey. I don't know what journey we're on, but he's definitely got Jasmine on a fucking journey. Okay? A desperate journey. Okay? A desperate journey as to when can she vlog him proposing, him giving her a real ring, not a glass ring from Walmart. Okay. Um, and a wedding. This woman wants to get married. Okay. Um, maybe she should, maybe she should propose to him. I mean, people do that nowadays. If he can't propose to you, like, what woman or what man just get up and go get married without a proposal unless you're in Vegas and you're drunk? You know? I mean, Britney Spears did it. And there he goes again. He spoke on a topic of conversation, right? That irritates him. That makes Jasmine, okay, looks good and give Jasmine um some kind of I don't know satisfaction but he wants y'all to know that I don't know I don't want to talk about, talk about this right I don't want to talk about this right now okay leave it alone enjoy the journey right but he didn't reassure her that he loves her he yarned over that. Okay? Moving on. I'm not putting you on front street. Why are you running your eyes? Because I'm waiting too, shit. Okay, well, shit, wait. All y'all wait. Hell. All y'all. Y'all don't know by now. When a man's ready to get married, he gonna marry. Put it like that. It's not up to the woman. So, oh, hold on. So if Jasmine's planning a wedding and you are ready to be married, who is Jasmine planning a wedding for? Who is she going to get married to if you're not ready? Did Jasmine make it seem like you guys got a date and there's things in the works, child? There's things out in the woodworks. Like she done got her wedding planner. She got her dress picked out. And she's saving up for the ring. So... If you're not ready, are you trying to play ketchup mustard because Jasmine is way ahead of you? And you see how this guy always have a freaking attitude on camera. 
He's never looked pleased, but Jasmine chooses to always push the camera in Chris's face. I just, I am. It's not, I, I didn't say anything. I'm just saying it's not. I gotta get permission from your father. I gotta get his hand to make sure it's okay. Like, it's up to us men. I do. She yeah. said, okay, just making sure you're still marrying, marrying beautiful Jasmine. Okay, you're not taking me either. It's a, it's a subscribe. A uh, supporter of uh, mine. Oh, okay. They still ain't checking me. They're not, hmm. but they're saying, like, he checked her, though. You are going to marry me. I don't know why this man always treat Jasmine's supporters like crap. Family, what you got going there, big dog? I guess Take the kids are with their he daddy. Love man facing forward now. Family, what you got going on, big dog? Propose to him. No, I'm not going to propose to him. No, why I'm not? Done. I was joking with her when I told her to, but I, I don't want that. I like a traditional style. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. Traditional style you know I mean? is you propose first. What you got going? You date the woman first. You, she, you, you get to know her children. Okay. Then you propose. Then you move in. Then you get married, and then you get then you have a baby. Okay. It's not the ass backwards way that you've been doing it. And others have done. Okay. No. Traditional way is that you pay the bills where she don't have to work so damn much. And you get a job that you can afford to keep a car that has her mama's name. A vehicle that has her mama's name on it. On it's her mama's name. Don't get fucked up if that is if that is so. Not but traditional. Now you are out of a truck. Damn. And then. And Jasmine's going to curse her mother out. Knowing that if that truck was in her mother's name. Her mother's credits done got messed up. What's up, baby? Hey, baby. Y'all, he be so lonely. Today I was working a lot today, so. I didn't really play with him as much. And he was Look. just like, I just felt so bad. He just looked so bored. Because usually, you know, he got somebody playing with <laughs> And he just was sitting over there by himself. I was like, poor baby. I like y'all's energy together. Thank you. What? Yes, he's facing forward. I always turn all my kids around. Okay, I I hope she meant the baby's energy in Jasmine because when Jasmine and that man over there is together, he looks like he is ready to just give the fuck up. Like, he just wants to get away. Look at his body language. He's all the way over there on the driver's side of the car. He's all the way over there. When they uh, turn one. When they turn one, I turn them around. Have you ever just watched them make the front? No. Is that what you're doing? That's why they got the mirror so you can, show, so you can see the line. Oh, we're at in and out oh, so, they they can't can, even see so they can show you the line, how they do everything. Oh. That's why I got these big ass windows right here. Yes, hit the like button. Ooh. Exactly. Chris will do it when it's the right time. Thank you. Every Thank time you. it's the right time. Thank you. Hmm. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't know Gracie Corner was a young black girl channel. Yes. yes she yes, has she over did. a million subscribers. She's yes, she does. Yes, she yeah. Does. Yep. And he loves to say Gracie's Corner. Doom, 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 doom. Aces. <laughs> Fucking back here somewhere. I don't wanna. There you go. Oh, you gotta fix this thing. Your strap. On your shoulder. There you go. It's so cold here. 
There you go. Gotta fix that stripe. Is it me or are these people who work at at, at In and Out with these bald faces and these black glasses, <laughs> bold black bold glasses? They look like Nazis. No, not everybody. I'm saying the guys, not the women. Oh, the I don't know. I don't have like the bold black glasses. Look at my bad movie. What you doing? Oh my God, Chris! Yeah. <laughs> Batman. You should have turned light on. Batman. Have you been watching any good movies on Tubi? I haven't been on Tubi. All right. Pizza today? Uh, no, thank you. It was the animal fries. Appreciate it. I have all the burgers right here. Did you get the drink? Hmm. No. Uh. -uh. What is this? Y'all. Yeah. Look at that. Ooh, this Appreciate it, boss. Pleasure. Enjoy. Hey, happy holidays, too. Happy holidays. Thank you. I just put the phone right there. In and out. Y'all want no extra fries? Y'all don't want to give an extra fry? Okay. You don't want to give an extra fry away? I was just playing, man. I was just, yeah, I right. Cool Your greedy ass with you, wasn't playing. Look how big your ass is. <laughs> he was looking too, like. Would have loved to have, have that damn fry. If that man gave you that fry, you would have taken it, Chris. Food. Don't act like you wouldn't have taken food. that darn fry. We're missing one. Missing what? There's only three burgers. Oh. You said what? Three little. I mean, it's two little ones. Make sure everybody pull up, though. They don't have to scoot back. They can't, but there's people behind them. We're missing one. So they got two. Look at that girl. Oh my god. Okay. okay. My <laughs> oh my god. I thought that Chris is like my hair. So crazy. late at it's night crazy. and about to go eat burgers. I'm going to look crazy. Okay. I so crazy. late at night and we are eating burgers. Today. Well, right now. When I was laying down. It was like, your hair is everywhere. <laughs> my forehead looks big. Yeah, my wig, girl. And other things. It's not just your forehead. And I just told him, I just told him this, that these people, oh wait, are they leaving? I just told him that too. I just said it. I said, don't block right here because there's people that are going to come out. Oh God, Jen, don't put your yeah. ass in front of the camera. Please don't. Try not to knock over the drinks, y'all. Oh my god. Oh. Thank you. Hold on, bitch. Don't hit me. I, I hate when he drives because I can't reach the fucking pedals. All right. Like that was uh, that. All right. This time. Around. Can I turn around? Sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm not the best driver, so work with your girl. That's why you got pulled over. Say, so don't hit nobody, mama. That's all he had to do. And the time I'm parking, the parking spot is right here. I can barely, I Oh my gosh, Shanada, you're blocked. I saw an old pics of you on Facebook. You looked cute with blonde hair and lip ring. So, the reason why I don't have a lip ring no more, I look fucking crazy right now, y'all. Like, really crazy. I had a wig on. So oh, please, my you don't care. Like, it was please, you don't care. If you I cared, you would not so be looking crazy. So, the reason crazy. why I don't have a lip ring anymore is because my coach that I can't have one. She was like, 
Athletes don't wear lip rings. <laughs> Athletes don't wear lip rings. So I had to take my lip ring out after I just got it done. But I told you don't park behind the car. Oh, what happened? Because they were trying to get out. Man, they could have waited. Um, are you sure there's no other burger in that bag? No, I looked. I looked. Yeah, they talking about it. they put it in the other bag. I was like, no, y'all didn't. Bro, I know I'm not tripping. I said, my lady said she got in, got in, put it in the other bag. I said, it's the number of fries. Yeah, it's just fries. That's all I'm saying. Huh. You want me to get back to the... Yeah, baby, Man, I can drive. drive. No. Yes, I can. You can drive like a brainy, no. I mean, I, it's because I can't really see where we are. Cold. 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 Late at night, and they're having burgers and french okay. fries. Not one, not two, but three. Oh my yeah, god! Yeah, I drive like a granny. I dr it's because I drive the speed limit. Let me move his badge. Come up here. It's because I drive the speed limit. That's why. That's the difference between me and Chris. I drive the speed limit. Oh shit! My thing is coming off. And his eyes goes above the speed limit. So did they give him the burger? So I moved over here for no reason. Because he is not even coming. I'm about to try one of these fries, though. About to try one of these fries. Of course you are. We'll just say the one on top is mine. One fry? Come here. She's still sniffing. None hasn't changed. Mmm. He loves French fries, y'all. That's one thing about his butt. Yep, we driving Miss Daisy because we didn't feel like taking. Bro, one thing I hate, one thing I hate about restaurants like this, you can't get mad and upset because y'all fucked up. Like, how you fuck y'all get mad at me because y'all fucked up? Nigga, like, fries on top of mine because I'm feeding he was, him some of them. He was like, um, oh, dude came and asked me. He was like, and what, what was it that we messed up on again? I said, y'all messed up on the double that's all the way, animal style. Yeah. And then the nigga who was making it, he was like, yeah, I'm, I'm getting it right. I said, bro, he came and asked me. Like, what the hell's your problem? We upset over a burger. You got your feelings, nigga, because you got a y'all fucked up. Get out of your feelings. I should be hiring teenagers, nigga. First time I had in and out, it wasn't you need a baby. job. It's, it's overrated. Okay. It's not. All right. Why don't you go work at in and out Because you are out of a vehicle. So you can pay for one. Because now you're going to inconvenience Jasmine and her responsibilities to her children as a mother. Doctor's appointments, grocery shopping, getting milk. Okay. So maybe you should go get a part-time job or another full-time job at in and out and try to, and probably, you know, train the young teenagers how to satisfy people like yourself. Now, don't get me wrong now. I, I, especially when it, when it, especially when I'm on a rush and I have somewhere to go, I'm always on a rush, but I, I don't like when I give, give my order specific order as to how I want my food and everything however when I get it, it's all kind of messed up I, I can't stand it I hate going back through drive through for my food because I don't know what they're going to do to my shit okay I get the frustration but you ain't got nowhere to go you have nowhere to go seem like you guys are the only customer that was in drive through it's not it really yeah not it is overrated. No, the way people kept hyping it up at first. That was my first burger when I first touched down in California to go who? My coach took me. This is the last burger. ride until we get home. Yeah, I'm getting mad. Man. <laughs> Sit your ass down, boy. Ain't nobody about to play with you, nigga. Y'all hear him yelling? Like, he doing his little yeah. grunting, I guess you could say. <laughs> no more, okay? I'll go on. I'll go on. Don't lie yeah, to your child. 
I was just trying to keep in contact because I wanted to try it too. See where kids learn how to lie? <laughs> See how they learn how to lie? Where go, Starts bye -bye. at home. Where's Digabug? There he is. Where's Digabug? There he is. <coughs> Like, what? We're going to try that Mexican spot right there, though. Yeah, y'all. We like Mexican, Mexican food. Fat man. Now you just love to eat, girl. <laughs> you mad at me. Fat man. Oh, yeah, we didn't even have seatbelts on. I even, well, I know I had mine on at first. <laughs> Good thing. Thank y'all for reminding me. And I'm wrong. I know my rights. No, yeah. I got. <laughs> Fat man, chill, bro. I, oh. I I get paranoid, but I. You're grown. You know your rights. The law says you're supposed to wear a damn seatbelt in your vehicle. That's what the law says. That has nothing to do with your with your rights. I should have gave you that fry. That's the right of the law, traffic law. Fat man. Get pulled over without your seatbelt and see if you don't get a damn ticket. You want some fries? Batman. Batman. I like I further up or something. He said, He said, mm. You're gonna lie to your son. All the fries are gone. All of a sudden, oh, French what? fries appear. Oh, so I'm so jealous y'all eating in and out. It's not, only, it's not an everyday thing, trust me. We, uh, we just both tired. And we don't I look was, like cooking. Yeah, and I was sitting on that computer. Like, I had another video to edit, and I just couldn't do it. I feel like my eyes started hurting because I edit two already, two and a half. And like I said, I was, I didn't say this to y'all, but I told Bay, like, I didn't go back to sleep, and I literally, he left, I stayed up, and I got straight on the computer and started filming and stuff. I kid you guys not. My grandson is a year old. He just turned a year old, like about um, two months ago. And he's talking, he's walking. Like, big man is like, Papa. More bacon, please. You know, or hi, Gigi. I love you. Or Papa. Okay. I boo boo. I mean, wow. 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 Like, talk to your child. I'm saying like baby should be spoken to not not like baby talk or stuff like that I just don't believe in that like I'm not sure if Jasmine's doing that or not I don't know but um can't believe that little boy can ask for a french fry he's screaming but what are you doing swallow like if your child wants something and they're Asking for it like that, say, no, french fries, please, you know, just make the words easy, not mama wants french fries, just like french fries, please, you know, or just say french fries, french fries, like, it's like, man, God, it's just, wow. Fucking fry. I thought you were swallowing it. I was just spit it out. 
It doesn't matter to anyone. It doesn't matter to any. I mean, he's supposed to chew and swallow, right? But Jazz, like Chris, Carrie, he is her man, not yours. Uh, I guess someone was talking mess, and it was correct. Talking, you know, having our back. Hey, you're going to wait till we get home now. I gave you one. <laughs> I love Mexican food. Hey, everyone. Hey, Lady Hutch. All right, I'm, I'm done with this because this is just really not going anywhere. It's boring as hell. Let's move on up and see what, what happens. There goes the big man. Uh -huh. <laughs> Nigga trying to look at me while you do. They don't care about you jamming to your music. Nigga jam to your music. They don't care. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> We got back home, please. Ah! That's why I told you. That's the that's the quickest way. That's what I was trying to tell you. Uh, I wouldn't have went that way. Cutting through, cut through that neighborhood fucks up the reception. And on top of that, it's How too many stops. There goes the big thing. Is that place from their house? And watch a movie. Or what? Yeah, we're going to watch a movie. Hey, guys, just real quick, though, before we get off a live. I'm going to say this again because I already said it the other night. I do not put my hands on Jasmine. I do not put my hands on the kids. Okay? Another thing is, y'all jumping in my inbox talking. Okay, fat man, you got it, bro. Y'all jumping in my inbox talking shit to me, thinking I'm going to nut buds. I'm not. Okay? I don't care. Please understand that. And I'm not telling y'all this to stop. I'm telling y'all that y'all wasting y'all time. Cause I don't have time to entertain the bullshit. I don't give a fuck. I'm just being real with y'all. Like, I don't know how calm I can say that, but I don't care. Y'all jumping in my inbox, talking shit to me and saying this and that and what, what. And then on top of that, calling CPS, telling me I'm doing all this crazy shit that y'all making up. Oh yeah, we got CPS call. Okay, I don't care. Okay, y'all are. I don't care because once they come over here to visit or call me or call Jasmine or whatever the case might be, they just gonna go back home to their regular lives and there's no type of case. It get dropped. So y'all wasting y'all time. So stop doing and that. I know I'm not gonna tell y'all stop doing it. I don't care. Just whatever. I don't care. That's why I'm at now. Like I'm, I, you know, time calling CPS. There's no telling y'all to stop. I'm not gonna tell y'all to stop because y'all gonna continue doing what y'all doing with y'all bitter asses. That's it. That it is what it is. I don't care. We're freaking so throwing them in the washer it, and that, dryer. That shit don't even matter. Yeah, it is what it is. Y'all do what y'all keep doing. What y'all doing? I don't care. I don't. It is what it is. But we just made it home, y'all. We just made it home. Yes, they will never take your kid. Well, you guys heard, um, Chris. He don't give a damn about whatever it is that you guys are saying in his DMs. So keep doing what y'all doing because he doesn't care. He's letting you guys know whatever you guys are doing or saying. He doesn't face him. Also, he's letting you know it's, it's broadcasting it out you know, on the 6 o'clock news that he does not lay hands on Jasmine or the children. Okay? He does not put hands on Jasmine or the kids. Maybe he, at one point he did, but he no longer does it. Maybe he, I don't know. I don't know. But Jasmine's telling us to stop talking about him hitting his woman. It's, 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 it's man woman because he does not put hands on Jasmine or her children and we need to let it go let it go let it go don't talk about it anymore he don't care what you have to say just let it go <sighs> Oh my God, he's so angry. Chris, why are you always so angry all the time? You just look so upset. I don't understand why Jasmine chose to put that camera in your face when you want nothing to do with her, the camera, and her subscribers. She just embarrasses herself every freaking time. But Jasmine is a glutton for punishment.
she is this thing is so freaking annoying oh my god home y'all we just made it home yes they will never take your kids because she's a good mother and chris is a good man huh. chris is a good man but he can't pay for yeah, a truck um, we made it home so we about to go in the house because think about chris is a good man who cannot stick to his end of a deal or a bargain or a commitment or to help you pay for something okay that he needs i mean chris is a good man to have you coming on your platform looking like shit not tell you baby you can't nah nah you got you got to come correct okay chris is a good man when he uses these vulgar tones on your channel knowing this is how you make your money okay i understand he's upset i understand his temperament but it's the deliverance can be better okay jasmine the deliverance can be better he will only say things when it when it benefits him but not when it praises you make it make sense Make it make sense. The only time you guys seem to do things is when your YouTube check comes in. You know, like, I don't, I've never seen Chris buy, buy you anything. Like, even maybe for the time I've been gone, he did. I may have to go check some videos and I'm not gonna, I don't have that kind of time. I don't have that kind of time. I have never seen Christopher buy you anything give you anything like like rub your feet a push give for his son never seen it i've never seen it but chris is a good man so a man that rides you when you or he needs to you know shoot off some sperm in you and give your babies a good man like I don't know Jasmine, but fuck, make makes sense. Y'all don't know what a good man is. Y'all don't know. Let me tell you something. When I broke my hip, my husband during the process, my healing process, my husband came. When I tell that man took care of me, I, I almost did not want my hip to heal up. Like I want just it to just <laughs> stay in my pain and my misery. The tension. The attention I got, the love I got, the, even though, you know, he's cooking, ain't that? Breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks in between. Every time I call, he came running, bathed me, you know, helped me to and from the restroom, empty my my bedside, commode my urinal, like, oh my God, wiped me down, dried me off, lotioned me up. Excuse me. So, my goodness. Right now, my three grandkids are with him. And they're having their grandpa time and breakfast, lunch, dinner, bath, reading time, TV time. You know, he just got back in from, well, not just now because late, but he was out earlier Christmas shopping for them and doing it. And I tell you, that's a man... Okay. Like, make sure all my bills are paid. And I mean, it's it's like, fuck. You know? It's more than just being dicked down, Jasmine. It's more than just having a man in your face. An angry man in your face. It's more than that. Jesus Lord, this thing is so annoying, y'all. It's so annoying. It goes up so quickly. It takes forever to... Okay, let me go back to this video here that I... Well, hopefully I can find it. This was some shit here when I saw this. I was like, uh-uh. I got to share this with y'all. This video right here. Oh, my God. Bitch, I'm outside of some movie. Blue 
rocking on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas haven't done my text. Look at the grease in this food. Like, hold on, it's coming. Right, look at this. Look at the grease. Look, look at the grease. Look, look, look. Nothing but freaking grease in that. Now, check this out. Hold on a second. Smile, babe. Look at this. Babe, smile. After work, I'm tired. Look at that. <laughs> oh my God. The, hold on. Let's 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 play this back again. Hold on a second. Smile, babe. Babe, smile. After work, I'm tired. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Let's put it back again. Let's go back again. Let's go back again. The greasy ass food. Look at all that oil up in there. Look at that. Look at that. All that grease. Smile, babe. Babe, smile. After work, I'm tired. <laughs> After work, he's tired. Gotta get a smile. I mean, how fucking embarrassing. That man don't want nothing to do with Jasmine and her YouTube. No. Even though her food stamp money just provided a nice big ass steak with some Parmesan green cheese. I mean, Parmesan cream beans and some coconut shrimp. Was, couldn't even smile for that to show his appreciation Oh my God. Anyway, passions, that's it on that. I am done with this reaction video. Um, I'm tired. I'm way past my bedtime, honey. I'm at eight o'clock. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 9, 12 p.m. Oh my God, way past my bedtime, honey. God. I mean, it's so cold outside. My heat is at 75 and I'm still cold. Oh my God. But anyway, passions, that's it on that. I am done. And all I can say is, you know, we got to be grateful for the hands that feed us. We got to just be more appreciative, learn how to talk to people, you know, like Chris don't have to like what Jasmine does for financial means, but he can respect, okay. He can respect the game. Okay, I mean, it's just it's just sad the way this man acts when she brings out the camera. Um. Yeah, so y'all hear what Chris said. He does not lay hands on Jazz and her children, but no abuser is going to say that he abuses. So we don't know. I don't know, and I don't care. I just pity the fool. I just pity the fool. And we're passions. <laughs> Merry Christmas. I'm so tired. Merry Christmas. Guys, I hope that you received everything or some of the things your heart desires. And, you know, remember what Christmas, Christmas is all about. It's the gift of God, the gift of his love, and it's, you know, the birth of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Okay? Remember that. And he is the gift. He is the most precious gift of all. There's no price tag. Okay? For that kind of love. It's for free. It's free. It's always there for you. You know? The greatest gift is his love. Unconditional love. He loved us so much that he died for us. Yes, he did. And I'm so appreciative, even though my home is not as festive as it normally would be. Even though my heart is aching a little bit. I'm sure we aching more tomorrow when I 
Look at my brother's picture. Um, I'm so thankful. I'm thankful for this day and all the days that has passed and all the ones to come. As I get older, every single day that I live, I, I, I am so much more grateful than I, was, than I was the day before because the closer you get, the older you get in age, the closer it gets to your end of time, the end of your time. And I'm just so thankful to God that, you know, my family's here, that we're all, we're here. We may not all be in the same place, in the same state, under the same roof, but we all share the stars and the sky. We're all underneath the same sky. So, with that said, guys, um, Merry Christmas. And see you guys next time. Bye for now.